Welcome back to the channel. I'm your host, Smile19. So today we're back on Snow Run and we're going to continue on checking out Remo's Tough Truck map. Uh, so I've already done a video on this on this map, uh, part one. So if you guys haven't watched that video, make sure you jump back and check that one out. Uh, so let's get right into this one. So uh, like the first video, I got just some random trucks placed at some random events. Uh, in this one, we're going to be checking out Obstacle Course 1 obstacle course two and hopefully if we got time that we'll do the hill climb as well uh, I still have my K uh, the K series truck parked here at the train pole and I know I promised from the last video I would pull this train again but an unfortunate event happened after the video that won't allow me to pull this train again and if we got time I'll get to that I'll explain it more so let's not waste any more time let's jump right into this I'm excited to check out these courses uh, so like the first video, I'm using all John John Hot Rod mods. That's my guy. He's he's the real deal. He's one of my favorites in the community. So I'm gonna check. I'm gonna be running all his trucks again, starting with this bad boy right here. This is the Shorty Square Body. Uh, this is one of his older mods, but this thing is absolutely sick. As is all his stuff. So let's get right into it. Listen to that V8. Sounds good. Hopefully this obstacle course ain't too bouncy because like all of his trucks, I go with the biggest and best suspension, biggest tires. The only problem is that it makes them a little bit more tipsy. <laughs> so we'll try to get through this. Uh, if I roll over, that's game over. I'm not gonna try to get it back on its wheels. We're just gonna run till we tip and that's gonna do it. Because I have a bitch of a time trying to put these mods back on their wheels with a wench. I just, <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> um, so as you see, I just rolled through the start gate without activating the actual thing here. Uh, I'm just free running these courses. I don't want to try to hurry and beat any time. So I'm just taking my time. All right, let's get some. So I had a, somebody comment and ask me why when I take John mods, do I always take the biggest suspension the biggest tires and all that that's just what I'm into guys uh, that's my favorite thing I, I the bigger the better for me I love the big tires and the big suspension look it's what I'm into you know you guys can download John mods and and customize them any way you want that's the beauty that's the beautiful thing about his mods is the options he gives you when you're putting these together you can really make it your own and this is just what I'm into I'm into these big badass Chevys. Oh, don't tip, don't tip. There we go, nice. All right, so like I said in the first video, I'm not crazy about the crawling in this game whatsoever, but I wanna run all these courses. And it doesn't take away the fact that this map is absolutely awesome. Remo did a fantastic job on this. Um, and I think I mentioned this in the first video, but uh, we all know Remo makes beautiful, friggin gorgeous trailing maps and logging maps so when I seen this one in his workshop type deal oh, the mod IO website I was super excited to see what he could do with a map like this and he didn't disappoint because uh, he's got some good stuff going on on this map and I, I built a few of these myself you know I got the smartest flex park uh, I did the the truck truck night in America map I did the green hell truck night in America map so I, I love these obstacle course maps. They kind of take a break from the, it's just a different way to play the game, you know? You take a break from the regular trailing style of the map. Oh, come on, let's jump up there. We gotta get her at a little bit of an angle. Oh, we're sliding. All right, I need to come at this at a little better angle. I could just get one wheel to pop up there. There we go, there we go, got it, nice. Yeah, so that looked good. That was pretty awesome, actually. All right, here we go. Got some mud coming up. Whoa, whoa, shit, shit, shit. <laughs> okay, I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> God damn. 
All right, now that's a drop off. And since we didn't completely go on our roof, there we go. Release the winch. Damn. <laughs> okay. I was not expecting that, guys. That was a drop off. Holy shit. I felt like I was on a rock run a gaming map for a minute. He loves to do that shit. Surprised me with them drop offs. Let's blast through this mud. Like a boss. There we go. Nice. That was cool as hell. Alright, I ain't going, I ain't doing that. Oh, okay, he's got some ramps this time. Nice. Let's try to line this up, slow it down a little bit. Whoa, I'm right on that. I'm riding that e-brake all the way down. Oh, don't lose it. There we go. That's pretty cool. That's creative as hell. I like that. Wow, what a good job. <clears throat> Remo did a great... Remo maps are absolutely beautiful. He's making some incredible stuff these days. Nice, there we go. Got a little cement. I think these are like cement or steel. Oh, I hate these things. I, I think they call these, uh, like, what are they called? Tank traps or something? I have a bitch of a time getting through this stuff. And as bouncy as these friggin' mods are, this is gonna be a pain in the ass. I'm just gonna put one side right in the groove and see if we can't muscle up through here. That'd be pretty sketchy if you were actually driving this and scraping your whole driver's side along this bank. <laughs> there goes all that. Well, that's a lot of damage right there, but we'll be all right. <laughs> so that's why it's a video game, video game, not real life. Oh, damn, we're getting very... Oh, oh. I'm thinking I'm going to hook up the wench just to be safe. Give this a little bit of a pull here and there trying to keep it on its wheels. That's the thing, and I talked about it in the first video. The mod and it's not it's not a knock to John. It's not it's not a John mod. It's not his mods that I, I call light. You know, everybody's mods feel light on this game. It's just the way this game is. <clears throat> I'm yet to get in a mod that really feels heavy and not so, uh, like, really friggin' lightweight, you know? Like, look at this thing bounce around. I'm barely giving it any gas. I, I know it's on huge suspension and huge tires, but it, should, it still shouldn't be that bouncy, you know? All right, let's get up here. Ugh, that was cool. Yeah, this is awesome. I dig these kind of maps anyway. Like I said, oh shit, oh shit. <laughs> God damn. All right, let's, uh, I didn't completely wipe out, so. Oh, damn it. Ah, I keep hooking the friggin' wrong kind of tree. There we go. <laughs> the road run a horn. Alright, so I didn't exactly expect to roll up. I should have went a little slower over them. I won't make that mistake on the next obstacle. Yeah, that suspension work. Yeah, so like I was saying, it's not a, <clears throat> that's not a knock on John mods by no means. Yeah, it's everybody's mods that really feel incredibly light on this game. And that's the only gripe I really have with the game. Ooh, what the hell is that? Is that, we're at the end, right? Oh, that's the Baja track. We're still on the Baja track. Okay. So yeah, we're all set with this one. Let me repair that. It's going to look prettier than that. Stop. All right, so let's jump over into the next one, which is 
the trail rod. All right, so this is another really fun mod. This one's really old. I'm pretty sure John made this one of his first two to five mods, I think. Uh, but this thing's friggin' awesome. I've always been a fan of this one. The only thing I can never figure out with this mod is why I always have the shock in red. Every time I build this truck, and a couple of his other ones too. I don't know if I have the wrong suspension with the wrong tires. I don't think I do. I took the biggest suspension and the biggest tire, but maybe. All right, let's get it. This is obstacle number two. Oh, this is cool. Let's slow it down a little bit, see if we can get up over this. This is really cool. I got something very sim similar to this on on my flex park map. Oh, this is interesting. Got these. Uh, what the hell are these called? I can't think for the life of me what these are called. <laughs> so I ain't gonna try to guess. I, I know what they are. I just can't think of the name of them. The brain fart. Got the logs. Did I even say what this mod is? This is the trail trail rod, which kind of looks like a, an old, what the hell is that Jeep called? Uh, Wrenching Monkey has one on Mod Runner. Oh man, I should have did some research. I'm forgetting everything tonight. <laughs> this is cool. I like this little hill. Oh, those loose stones are gonna cause some problems though. If I hit one the wrong way. Oh, 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 back up a little bit. Roll it back. Oh, I don't want to lose this right now. But I don't want to go any faster because I'm afraid I'll bounce right off the damn trail. Oh, we're getting it now. Nice, that's a cool trail. I like that trail. That didn't feel too bad either. Get a sketchy little bridge here. Slow it down a little bit. I didn't even see what this horn said. Oh, he's got the road runner on this one too. I'm just waiting for John to, like I said, I think I said this in the first video too, but uh, I'm waiting for John to hit us with like Godzilla or, or Dukes of Hazard or something, you know, something like that for a horn. I think I like this obstacle a little bit more than the first one. I like the, the different events here. The different challenges, I mean. Yeah, that was really cool. And there we go. Made it over that one. That was pretty awesome. Got a little bit of damage, not too much. Let's repair that. <laughs> All right, let's jump over in the last one, which is the crew cab. Probably not the best truck for this event. And that looks very steep. I don't know if we're gonna make this, but we're gonna give it a try. <laughs> All right. You know what? I just, did I just not just say the Duke's a hazard? Why haven't I never, I could have sworn he had a few trucks with the Dukes of Hazard horn. And there we go. <laughs> I totally forgot. I haven't driven this truck in a while. It's been a long time. So I take that back. He already has that. So let me change the time. Let's get back to day. There we go. All right. So like I said, this pro, I don't know how this is going to go with the big crew cab, but we're going to try it. I'm not going to go up into high just because I think it'll go up too fast. So I'm going to keep it at a basic pace here for now. Oh, of course it shifted on me. Maybe I am going to have to go up in high. All right, guys, let's uh, let's take this from the get-go again. This truck's friggin' awesome. I was just thinking maybe the, the long wheelbase might help me on this hill a little more. Maybe keep me on my wheels better than a short base would. We are going to go in high. Let's get some.
<laughs> Love it. Oh, see, that's what I was worried about. Getting a little bouncy. Come on, girl. Let's go. Damn. <laughs> Bouncing all over the place. But you really can feel how light this mod is. And you guys can probably see how light this mod is. Just by the way it's taking these bumps and stuff. It really bounces around. But that was fun. It's still fun, you know. Yeah. I think we got over the steep part of it. rolling with me. Look at that view. That looks sick. Yeah, I can't say enough about the map. Remo, you did a great job, man. This is a really fun map. Uh, I still got, still got some more stuff I gotta do on this map. So let me finish up this course real quick. We'll probably start finishing up the video. jump over to the train pole because I got to talk about that really quick damn this is a long long hill climb look at that the old long bed Chevy did it though and we kept it on the wheels okay the ends right there That was awesome. <clears throat> that really was cool. One more time. <laughs> Alright, so let's jump over in the K-Series. Let's talk about this. So you can see I still got it parked where, where I parked it in the first video. Uh, we made it pretty far with this thing. Unfortunately, the train just rolled back. Okay? <laughs> and when it did... Let me go down now. When the train rolled back, it went off the tracks. And I've already tried to pull it with another mod and it won't budge. So I'm probably gonna have to reset this map to get it to go back on the tracks. You can see it's right off the tracks. It's leaning over there. So I don't think the pulling is gonna happen on this video. Uh, it, it really ain't gonna happen. I don't think I can move it with even this truck. Let me see. We'll check that really quick. And then we'll stop doing the closeouts. I don't think it's going to pull with this one. It didn't with the other one. Yeah, see, she ain't even budging. It's right off the track. So, unfortunately, I'm going to have to reset the map, rebuild the mods. That, that's another thing I really hate about SnowRunner. I wish I could build the truck once and put it in the garage and bring it on every map I want to bring it on without having to rebuy it, rebuild it every single time. That's the worst part. But I mean, you you kind of have to do that on spin tires and mud runner too. But uh, anyway, guys, I think that's going to do it for this video. Um, I do still have other courses to check out. We can still check out the Baja track. Uh, I'm still very curious to see what this is. I want to see what this is. Um, we still got another obstacle course to run over here. So I probably will make a part three to this video. And we'll check out these last few things I want to check out. Uh, but yeah, so we'll, we will probably make a part three at some point. So anyway, guys, that's going to do it for this video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't. And I will talk to you guys again real soon.